Apparently, we fired up the City TV satellites, pointed it to London, and live from London, joining us right now, Idris Elba, starring in the brand new movie, No Good Deed. Good to see you, sir. Last time we had you on, you were talking about the iconic role of Mandela. This time, the uh, menacing ex-con. You are almost too good in this movie. Oh, no, it's a bit scary how much I actually enjoyed playing someone so uh, psychotic. But nice to be back. Thank you. Yeah, I'm proud of this film. It's a good, good old fashioned thriller. You know, it's designed for, uh, you know, a good Friday night out. And I think, you know, audiences will love it, man. It just, do you ever get to a point where you do these roles and your friends and family are seeing you on screen and thinking, wow, who knew he could be so scary and psychotic? <laughs> yeah, I watched this film with an audience and I was scared. I was like, whoa, this is, uh, this is a bit disturbing that I'm, I'm that compelling. Uh, you know, not to toot my own heart, horn here, but the character is really full on, you know? So, uh, uh, yeah, my friends and family are a bit like, are you okay, man? You want okay? you want to hug? You want to talk about it? <laughs> and let's talk about this one. Taraji P. Henson, we just saw on screen right there, starring alongside you. She was producing uh, the idea and the story behind it. What was so compelling for you to jump on and be a part of the project? I mean, look, you know, it's it, the truth of the matter is a very violent, you know, disturbing story. But uh, the experience of film is that we take audiences on a journey. And in this film, this is like a roller coaster ride, you know, there's a, you're not sure what's going to happen next. And then there's an amazing twist and there's a, a real sort of, uh, you know, uh, you, you see the human spirit come alive, especially in uh, Taraji's character. And so it's really designed to, for people to go, you know, on the first date on Friday and uh, you, I guarantee, you, you know, you'll have a good time. And I know Taraji P. Henson uh, had a, a crucial role in getting you on board. She calls it the best performance ever, the phone call to convince you and say, we need Idris, he's the guy. Uh, how was she so persuasive to get you on board? Uh, she screamed at me. She said, how <laughs> could you do this? You better do this. You better do it. I was going to come over there and kick your butt. That was the conversation. I was like, okay, Taraji, I'll be there. Click. She's got quite the charm. Quite the charm right there. So hold on. No good deeds out in theaters this weekend. Idris, yeah. I quickly want to ask you about this because this is an important event. Uh, Stand Up to Cancer coming up over in the UK. We had a, a profound and powerful broadcast here in Canada. This is a personal issue for you, and we've got the ad that you are involved with to support this cause. Tell us about that. Yeah, you know, uh, you know, as you know, you know, my, my father died from cancer, and it was. Uh, very important for me to help uh, stand up for cancer who I have helped in the past for awareness uh, get this new campaign out um, it is you know the most crippling disease that we have been fighting as a race for a long time and you know we need to band together to get it to get rid of it so you know I definitely uh, it was an easy decision for me to get involved with it with that campaign and, uh, you know, I hope it, it's successful and I hope it raises as much as awareness as it can. Well, it's a great cause to get behind. Congratulations on being a part of that. And, of course, no good deed out in theaters this weekend. Idris, great chatting with you. Thanks for being with us on BT Vancouver this morning. Thank you, Riaz.